I'm going to show you how to make onigiri with teriyaki chicken. These Japanese rice balls are very easy to make. Here, they are made with karaage chicken and teriyaki sauce. Take one pound of chogren rice. Watch them three times. Let them soak for 30 minutes. Cut two chicken thighs into chunks. Keep their skin. It is delicious once fried. Season them with one teaspoon of grated ginger, two cloves of chopped garlic, one pinch of salt, one quarter teaspoon of ground paper, one tablespoon of cooking sake, and one tablespoon of dry soy sauce. Mix everything and keep aside. After 30 minutes of soaking, drain the rice. Cook it with 2 cups and 1 eighth cup of water. Cut each piece of chicken with potato starch. Heat the oil to 340 degrees. Fry the chicken over high heat for 5 minutes. Stir twice for even cooking. Remove the pieces and put them on the rack. Cut them into small cubes. In a pan, put the ingredients for the teriyaki sauce, 2 tablespoons of cooking sake, 2 tablespoons of mirin, 2 tablespoons of light soy sauce, 1 teaspoon of dark soy sauce, and 2 tablespoons of sugar. Mix. And heat it over medium-low heat. When it starts to boil, turn to low heat and let the water evaporate for about 8 minutes. The flavors mix and concentrate. We see many small bubbles and the sauce has thickened. Add the chicken, turn to medium heat, stir for one minute. Each piece of chicken is coated in sauce. Cut the fire. To make onigiri, we need a bowl of water, some salt and a wet cloth. We can use onigiri molds, a cookie cutter, or just our hands. The rice is cooked. Fluff it to lower the temperature and release the steam. Cover it. Cut four sheets of nori seaweed in two. Rinse the mold to prevent the rice from sticking to it. Soak the hands in water. Double them on the cloth. The rice is hot, but not burning. Take some and put it in the mold. Garnish with teriyaki chicken. And cover it with rice. Turn the mold over and take out the rice balls. Put a little salt on the palms. Gently squeeze each bowl of rice. It doesn't matter if they are not triangle or if their shape is not regular. Place each bowl on the piece of nori and wrap it with it. Press them gently. Place a few pieces of chicken on top to show what filling it contains. Here's how to make them with a cookie cutter. The onigiri are ready. You can take them anywhere. Bon appétit! The rice is soft. 
it is not packed. The small pieces of chicken are still crispy, with their teriyaki sauce. They bring a lot of flavor to the onigiri. Thank you. See you at the next homemade dish on Morgan Recipes.